How's it going? This is Brian Lee from Walzer Burnsville Mazda. I'm excited to show you the Mazda 6 today. Um, there's a lot of cool things on it. This one in particular is the signature trim level, meaning it's fully loaded for the year. It's going to have all of the available bells and whistles um, for the Mazda 6. Excited to take you through that. They're fun, they're comfortable, and they're really good looking, in my opinion. So, taking a look at the front here, you can see Mazda's signature headlight design. Aggressive, good looking, as well as LEDs come standard on these cars. You've also got your integrated fog lights in there as well. Taking a look at the grille, you can actually see that this one's going to be a little bit different than some of the other trim levels. This one, again, being a signature, is going to give you the gunmetal gray grille versus the black. Right in your emblem and directly underneath it is your first set of cameras. Other set of cameras is right on top of the windshield there. Those are going to be integrating Mazda's full suite of eye active safety sensors, radar cruise control, lane departure warning system, forward collision, as well as a couple of other things. This one, again, being signature, is going to have front and rear parking sensors. I'll show you the rear ones once we get over there. Underneath the hood, you're going to have the 2.5 liter engine uh, with the turbo, 250 horsepower, 310 pound feet of torque. Again, if you don't need that, if you're not looking to win any races, we do have a couple different trim levels, Sport Touring, Grand Touring, Grand Touring Reserve, and the Signature. New for 2021 is also the Carbon Edition, which gets you the Poly Metal Gray exterior, red interior, as well as black wheels and a couple of different black accents. Be excited to show you one of those once you come into the store as well. Taking a look at the front here, you can see you do have a lot of good things on the inside here. So you're gonna have up on top there your wood trim. Right underneath it is the ultra suede inserts. And then again, quick look at the brown interior. This is Kartura Brown Napa leather. Power passenger seat, heated and cooled front seats. Two zones of climate, as well as up on the dash, you're gonna have all of the cool stuff. Lots and lots of technology here from Mazda. Um, we can go through some of that stuff once we get into the vehicle, um, as well as the suede does extend all the way across the dash. Quick look at the rear, very similar to the front. So on the door, you're gonna have all of those nice accents. And then in the center here, you actually have your vents for any rear passengers that you might have, as well as heated rear seats in this trim level and two USB ports for charging devices. Keep making our way toward the rear here. Lots and lots of cool stuff on the back here. You can actually see down underneath, you're gonna have your parking sensors and your backup camera, which does come standard on the Mazda 6. You got the signature badge and the turbo badge, one on either side, making it even, as well as showing other people that you have a cool car. Go ahead and pop the trunk open here. As you can see, you've got a ton of space inside of there. Those, forward, those uh, front seats do fold forward as well. Down underneath, you're gonna have your spare tire, which again, I hope you never need to use. You do have three years, 36,000 miles of both bumper to bumper and roadside assistance. We're gonna keep making our way around here. Of course, sharp looking wheels for a sharp looking car. 19 inch wheels are available on this vehicle. Um, come standard on the signature trim level, but no matter which car you go with, they're all gonna look great, especially on the carbon edition with the black wheels. Integrated into your mirror is your blind spot monitoring. Um, again, top outside corner of each mirror. It also integrates your rear cross traffic alert um, so that when you're backing out of a parking spot, it'll beep and it'll alert you if somebody's back there. Quick look on the inside of the driver's side. You can see again, all of the nice accents, same as the other sides, power folding mirrors. Down underneath, looking at the seat, you can see that it is a memory driver's seat with lumbar support. We're gonna move our way up just next to the steering wheel. You can actually see all the other buttons that come available in this car, just to show you again, there's a lot of cool features. You can do uh, track control on off. You can also turn your lane departure warning system on off, 360 degree monitoring as well as parking sensors on or off. We're gonna take a look at the inside of the Mazda 6. Again, there's a ton of cool features. I'm really excited to go through that with you. We're gonna start off on top here and we're just gonna take a look at the moonroof. Um, making our way down, you're gonna be able to see your LED lights as well as your frameless auto dimming mirror with home link. Just below that is your Mazda Connect system. As you can see on here, there's a lot of different things you can do, applications in here, travel link, fuel economy monitor, vehicle status monitor. Making our way over to entertainment. This is gonna do with your radio, Bluetooth controls. Uh, you can play your phone music through the Bluetooth system. Communications, again, vehicles are equipped with Bluetooth. That's gonna do your phone calls, text messages, things like that through the system. Navigation for vehicles that are equipped, as well as in-car settings. So you can actually change a lot of the settings for the vehicle. Taking a look up on top here, you can actually see you've got your Apple CarPlay system. This is integrated into the car. Um, you can do audiobooks, podcasts, all of that cool stuff right from here. 
Just below that, you can see your hard buttons for all of your climate control, heated steering wheel, heated and cooled front seats. Just behind that, you're gonna have your automatic transmission. Again, with manual mode, you can pop that over, actually uh, shift gears up and down. You also have paddle shifters on the steering wheel as well. Just behind that is gonna be your sport mode button. Again, super fun car, sport mode helps. Behind that is the controls for your infotainment as well as volume and your parking brake and the auto hold feature. Cup holders just behind that. This does open and close and two USB ports inside of there. Up to the steering wheel on the right hand side, you can actually see your radar cruise control settings, set a speed or a distance, on off. On the left hand side, you've got your audio controls, voice commands and phone controls. Quick look up on the dash there, you can actually see this is what your digital display is gonna look like. Just by pressing the info button on the steering wheel, you can actually scroll through some of these different cool things. Trip A, trip B. This one here is gonna show you all of the other things that come integrated with your car, like your radar cruise control, blind spot monitoring, all of those cool things. Be happy to go through that further with you when you come into the store. Service intervals, compass with your range till empty, and then back to the off screen. Again, my name is Brian Lee. Thanks for hanging out with me and checking out the Mazda 6. If you'd like to take one out for a test drive, I'd be happy to go through that with you. Give me a call or check us out at walzer-mazda.com.